Remember the long lines last summer at O'Hare? Security checkpoints kept people waiting and waiting. Who could forget them? But just in time for Thanksgiving, changes at O'Hare Airport to speed you right through. CBS 2's Vince Girasoli shows you how it works. Catherine, flying home to North Carolina, knows she can't control security wait times. If you plan and you think you have an hour, that line will slow you down and you'll get nervous. <laughs> Six months ago, a TSA staffing shortage plus an uptick in travel caused massive waits of nearly two hours at O'Hare and airports nationwide. We're very excited about it. It also fast tracked the introduction of five new automated security screening lanes at O'Hare. Here's how they work passengers grab a 25% larger bin that's robotically replaced on the bottom and then place their contents inside. When you're done push, uh, putting your belongings in the bin, you can simply push your bag bin over and then you can make your way on. Bags are photographed and bins electronically tracked. Any luggage with questionable items is automatically diverted onto a secondary screening lane. American and United Airlines have reportedly invested millions in the upgrades. It improves your processing time by anywhere from 25 to 50 percent. With officers less concerned about restacking bins or locating flagged luggage, the TSA says there's more time to focus on safety. From a security perspective, it allows for less mistakes. Average security wait times at O'Hare are now five minutes or less, but that's required assistance from many departments. It's been all hands on deck between uh, aviation, security, CPD. Now, new technology could have have shorter wait times in the bag. Now these systems were already in place at airports in Europe like London's Heathrow. You'll find two at O'Hare's American Airlines terminal and three others at United's. Uh, American Airlines also says that they have them online in Newark and Los Angeles and American alone is spending 26 million dollars on the upgrades to help passengers fly by security. In the newsroom, Vince Girasoli, CBS 2 News. Oh, something to make traveling easier finally, Vince. Thanks. <laughs>